you understand how to simultaneously add color as well as marker to your dots next task for all the practice they are asking you are using one more thing face color so try we will try running this part of the line in our code and see how it is going to change our plot inside cyan i am going to fill inside this cyan i am going to fill it with cyan color itself marker face color comma cyan so marker edge color is also cyan marker face color the edge color is going to be blue by default and marker face color is going to be cyan difference you can see between both the diagrams here inside the circle is not filled and here the circle is filled with cyan color this looks nice right so it's it's a, a sine wave which is marked uh, which is plotted using markers very simple next task we are going customize electricity usage plot so same way i am loading the electricity map see here it is going to have three things fitted residential here i am going to have three variables See the first thing plot the residential electricity usage as a function of year. So I'm going to plot x axis is going to be year, y axis is going to be residential. That is given in the question. And additionally, they are uh, giving us the features with a solid line and circular markers. So circular means you know high is zero. O hyphen of size 6 and the custom color color is also given so i am going to use color and i am going to give the rgb value 0 0.7 0 0.9 1 and the marker size they have given you are going to use the property marker size or the marker size value is given as 6 I hope this one is correct. We we'll see if it is correct. Yes, but MATLAB has to say here all ticks we should get. I think it's no, is the marker color correct? So the marker color is not correct. I think this uh, marker color should be given somewhere. We'll see the solution. What is wrong? Not year, comma, residence. We'll copy this and see where we have gone wrong. Okay. So this is given by MATLAB. Marker size is six. Marker face color, yes. So in the, I should not use the simple color. I should use marker face color. Marker face color. Now I think uh, it should be the same thing with MATLAB. We'll submit and see whether we are getting all the ticks. Yes. Yes. Okay. We executed the command. See, uh, live, you, you make mistakes, you can understand where you have made mistakes, and MATLAB provides function for that. Okay. Add a plot of fitted model as a function of year. So uh, now I am going to use plot yr, test fitted, the second variable, using a solid red line. So for red, you know the color is R with the line width of 2. For line width, you have a command. Line width comma two. I hope this command is correct. We'll see. Getting okay, this, we'll see in MATLAB whether we are uh, answer is correct or not. It's the correct data plotted. The correct data plotted. We have to check what is the mistake. See the solution. You have to use hold on and hold off because it is having multiple lot of values. We'll try giving hold on. After plotting all the things, you have to give hold off. Now we'll see if it is correct. Yes. We are plotting two things in the same thing. You are able to understand? So plot here, comma, restricted and plot here, comma, residential. Okay. Now I think MATLAB should say whether the answer what we got is correct or not. You should get all ticks. Yes. 
add a legend so you can add a legend another notation you know how to add a legend i am not going to you can modify the x limit and y limit so see if you are giving this command means and uh, see here the graph is ending in 2015 but the graph is plotted in 2020 right so you can exactly finish at 2015 so that is what mentioning the x limit so if you run this you see the graph will be perfectly along the along the length at 2015 Unwantedly, this blank space is there, right? So you can remove that. You can remove that blank space by uh, saying that the limit is only from 1990 to 2015. 1919 is first element of year, and 2015 is last element. In MATLAB, when you use the command n, it refers to the last element of your array. So you see the graph area is fully filled, and you don't have any blank space as you have here. Okay, that is one thing. The summary what we have seen different colors the codes and what are the different properties we use for plotting the things that is